Hey guys, okay. So, I was recently contacted by a popular makeup YouTuber on face on Facebook. She contacted me. Um, her name's Natalie. You may know her as Purple Stars 1986 on YouTube. And she had this great idea to do a St. Patrick's Day collaboration. And which I thought was really cool that they included me that she included me in that message because nobody ever asked me to do one before and I've always wanted to do a collab but um nobody ever asked me and so when she asked I was like okay yeah sure I'm game let's do this so the look I came up with is called it's called Golden Rock it's based it's inspired by um gold the gold and the pots of gold and shamrocks um like I used the black and the gold to um, as the pot of gold and then the green as the shamrocks. So um, that's what it looks like. I even attempted. This one didn't come out that good. This one came out better. <laughs> I attempted to double wing my liner. But... I'm, I'm used to doing a single wing and it's just having to do two. It's new. Um, so I was like, hey, why not try it? You know, YOLO. <laughs> Anyways, um, that's what I did and let me show you all the products I use. Well, first, as my base on my lid, I use Benefit Creaseless Eyeshadow Liner and I use the color RSVP and it's this really gorgeous pink tan color um, which is one of my favorites I, I don't I don't use it as often as I should um, then on top of that I use NYX Pearl Ultra Mania Yellow Gold and um, then I took my 88 color 88 tropical matte shadow palette from BH Cosmetics and I used a few colors from that. Um, the green, I used this green over here. Oh, you can't see it. Oh, there you go. Right there. And then I used this gold, this goldish brown color up here. Um, and then I also used the black that's in here. And then I used this green to kind of darken it a little bit. Um, then to add a little bit of shimmer in the shamrock. <laughs> I like that. Shimmer the Shamrock. Um, I used Ulta Minerals in Jade. Which is one of my favorite colors right now. It has a really gold, pretty gold sparkles in it. Um, you think Jade, you think straight up green. But it has gold sparkles in it. And it's really pretty. It's one of my, one of the prettiest colors I have. Um... And uh, for the lip, I didn't do much with the lip. Um, I used my favorite lip gloss. This is Luscious by Sonia Kashuk. That's the color. The color name is Luscious. And I got this for my birthday one year. One of my last year actually. Um, one of my best friends gave it to me, and I have been using this like crazy. The money well spent. Um. And then for mascara, I used Dior Show, which is my favorite mascara right now. This was like a trial that I got from Ulta, I think. I want to get, I want to get some a full size. I like it because of the brush. I want to get the full size one because, but the only thing is Ulta here where I live is so far out. It's it takes about thirty something minutes to get down there, and I'm like. I can't do that all the time. And besides, my gas mileage is not that good in my car. So, um, I used that. 
And I used my the liner I used was Mary Kay. Um Black is Black, I think that's what it's called. And um and yeah. Um don't forget to check out all the other really great looks from the other ladies down there in the description box. Right here. And um I am going to go ahead and let you watch the look and I hope you enjoy it. And I'll meet up back. I'll meet up with you back at the end. All right. This is the look that I'm doing for St. Patrick's Day. So, um I already I already did my face makeup and I based one of my eyes and this is what it it should turn out to look like. It'll be better or worse depending. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and jump into what I did. Um, this is the first time I'm explaining what I do, so bear with me. Um, first thing, the first thing that I did was I had to get a base, um, just for the lid. I used Benefits, um, Creaseless Cream Shadow Slash Liner. And I use a color called RSVP. And it's kind of like this really pretty pinkish tan color. It's a gorgeous color. Um, so I just took my finger and I just put it on put it on my eye. So I'll go ahead and do that. did that the next thing that I did was I since that creaseless is, is shadow that I just used is a little bit sticky the reason why I use it is it's a little bit sticky I'm using it because um, you know I'm using I'm about to use a pigment which is the NYX ultra pearl mania yellow it's it's just gold it doesn't have a special name um, I took this brush, it's a skinny brush, I guess you could call it a pencil brush, um, and I just put it on this part of my lid. The next thing I did is I took from my 88 color matte palette from BH Cosmetics, I took this thin brush right here, and I'm put, using this green. And I'm just going to put it on the outer V of the outer corner of my eye so you can see it. This is matte, so I want to add a little bit of sparkle to it. So what I took, what I'm going to take next is Ulta Jade. It's yeah, it's called Jade. It's their mineral powder eyeshadow. I want to take this same brush.
Next, um, this is something I'm adding. I want to take this kind of brush and put it into this pretty gold color, right, right here, and just put it into, you know, add it to the gold that's already there. Um, blending, if I can find it. I'm going to take a fluffy brush. Ah, right here. Well, not a fluffy brush. It's a blending brush. Next thing I'm going to do... I am going to take a little bit of black just to add a little to add make it a little bit darker. I'm going to take this kind of fluffy brush and put it in to the black in this same palette. I'm getting a lot of these colors from this palette, which I love this palette. I haven't used it enough, so I'm decided to use it right now. So what I do is I'm going to kind of Put it at the this part, the sharp V of my eyeshadow, of the green eyeshadow. This is where I get kind of fancy with my eyeliner. I don't usually get fancy with eyeliner. But I take, uh, this is, actually this is eyeliner from Mary Kay. I've had this for the longest time. I like it because of this. It's more like a felt tip. So it's easier to use. Then what I want to do is I'm going to get some more eyeliner on the on the brush, and I'm going to kind of make it a double wing. For this look, you don't need too much of a highlighter because there's so much going on anyway. But you can put one on there. if You can put a highlight if you want to. I didn't. Really? Yeah, I didn't because there was so much going on on the lid and the crease area that I was like, a highlighter would be a little too much going on. Um, then finally put on my mascara which um this is my favorite mascara this is a sample it's almost gone it's Dior show I really want to get some one day but I haven't been able to go to Ulta or wherever you can get this you can get it at Ulta Shamrock and gold. 
So, I hope you enjoyed that. And I hope that wasn't too... There wasn't too much going on. It's kind of... It's very bold color. This isn't something I would wear on a regular basis. I usually go for the gold and brown. <laughs> in my opinion. But, you know, it's fun to play it up a little bit. And, and that's... That's, that's basically what I did. Hope you enjoyed it. And I hope it helped. And I love you guys for watching. Alright. I hope you enjoyed that look. I hope you liked it. And I hope it helped. Um, like I said. All the, the, the links to the other. The other looks are going to be in the description box below and I'll link Natalie's channel somewhere in around my head um somewhere around my head and thank you all so much for watching and I love you for watching have a happy St. Patty's Day